Hi everyone, Farmer Dale here at Cannon Hall Farm. Um, I'm having a walk down to see the Shire horses. Um, I've got one just behind me. Can you see her? And there's Blossom. Um, Blossom has currently got a pretty, uh, pretty heavy fly coat on. She does, um, she does struggle with sweet itch, so that's what she's uh, looking like. That it's not her we've come to see today, though. I thought we'd come and see Lottie, Ruby, and. Orchid and it's Ruby and Orchid I want to talk about really because they're the ones that we're trying to breed with Which is a big part of what we do here at the farm. The Shire horses have become an increasing part of our of our Breeding program as uh, the years have gone on. We've had them for oh, about five or six years now at least uh, We've welcomed a good few foals uh, and we're, we're trying for some more because they're a really important breed and one we want to save So today we're gonna go down and have a quick chat about uh, these two special horses Right then here they are triple threat eh? they're all stood together all being well behaved uh, they do get on quite well these horses um, so who's who <laughs> uh, just at the front here this is Ruby she's actually the uh, the smallest of the all the horses that we have and then just behind her is um, is Orchid and there's Lottie just there like I say it is it is Ruby just here and Orchid that I mainly want to talk about because they are our, our breeding females they're the ones that uh, are hopefully going to provide some falls now they have been off Orchid is recently back at the farm after spending quite some time away at the stud in uh, in the hope of her getting in fall which we, we think she is now we're hoping that she is uh, as long as everything has gone to plan and the same with Ruby now the Shire horse is a really really important breed to us here you know we've been We've been trying to breed them, trying to make sure there's plenty of them around for quite a few years and um, we are doing well. Both um, Sapphire, who's currently away at the minute getting a little bit of extra training, and Will, who, le who recently left us to become a, a hopefully become a stud horse. So, um, I thought you'd like a little update on how they're doing. They are, uh, they're a long way off yet. It's a very long gestation or a very long pregnancy for a Shire horse. Um, it's going to be... Um, a good few months yet until there's any signs of them really um, showing until they're showing any signs of giving birth but um, I thought you'd like to have a look at them and see how they're doing and see how they're going on and really give you an update on their progress so that's um, that's very exciting next year we are very very hopeful to welcome some falls here at the farm right guys so thanks very very much for watching i hope you've enjoyed that little update we are super excited at the potential and it is still potential at this point to welcome um, some sh more shire horse foals next year um, fingers crossed that the stallion has done his job uh, and we should have two of the little shire foals thanks very very much for watching catch you soon and i'll see you see you later guys oh looks like they've had enough too